My name is Nathan Bendick and I'm an environmental scientist for the Watershed Protection Department with the City of Austin. Today we are at Eliza Spring. We were doing a capture recapture survey here for the Barton Springs salamander, which means that we catch the animals, we photograph them, and from those photographs we can tell if we've seen the animal before or not because of the unique patterns on their head and their body. We can tell what proportion of this population are juveniles, adults. We also will check to see if they have eggs. The salamander's skin is translucent and you can see through their sides and through the bottom of the abdomen whether they have eggs in them or not. Barton Springs Pool is a public pool that's operated by the city of Austin. Because there are endangered species, the salamanders living in the pool, the city actually requires a federal permit to operate the pool. But we can't receive a permit without doing some conservation steps. So some of those things include habitat management, but also some of the science that we do for the species to expand our knowledge about them. And what we do, keep Barton Springs Pool open for the swimmers. The salamander populations here in the park have been monitored by the city since 1993. Last month, we saw a very large number of salamanders here, the most we've ever captured. We were getting about 900 a day. What we see are large fluctuations over the course of years, but a stable trend. We want to see evidence that the salamanders are still reproducing and kind of following the patterns that we expect. When you're here enjoying the pool, don't disturb any of the rocks because those things can harm salamander habitat. Salamanders can get crushed. Swim next to them, don't step on them.